What's going on guys? This is Barker, back with another NBA video talking about the NBA. And today, I'm talking about Matisse Thibel and how he just made history for the NBA. So if you don't know much about Matisse Thibel, uh, he's a shooting guard for the Philadelphia 76ers. He comes off the bench, he doesn't get that many minutes, only 20 minutes flat per game, only averages 4 points per game. But he averages 1.6 steals and 1.1 blocks. Is one of the best defenders in the league. And it just got proved this season because he just made an all-NBA defensive second team. All-NBA second team only averaging 20 minutes per game. That is absolutely nuts. And the craziest part is he just broke a record for playing the least amount of minutes while making an all-NBA defensive team. All NBA defensive team, 20 minutes per game, averaging 1.6 steals and 1.1 blocks on the defensive end. The man is an absolute monster. And the reason why I'm talking about this is, it's going to be a short video, but I'm talking about the fact that I think Matisse Thibault has the potential to be a future defensive player of the year. And I will say why. Uh, if you watch him play, he locks up. Locks up on defense. The on-ball... If he plays on-ball defense, he locks up the ball carrier. If he's playing off-ball, you have to worry if you're passing. You really do. He locks down all the lanes, so if you try to pass it far away, he's stealing that shit. Plus, if you try to take a jump shot in front of him, he will block that shit right in your face. Which is impressive. He's got that long wingspan for his position and height. Uh, I just see him being a future defensive player of the year. And I know it's hard for guards to make to become a defensive player of the year, but I think Matisse Thibel has the ability to do that, especially since the 76ers pride themselves on defense. Most likely I see him replacing Danny Green in the starting lineup because Danny Green really isn't all that, and he's a streaky shooter. And Matisse Thibel is kind of the same way, except better on the defensive end. I think that'd be a great fit for them. Ben Simmons and Joel Embiid made an all-NBA defensive team as well. Showcasing as well that they are one of the best defensive teams in the league. And I said right before that Matisse Thibel played the least amount of minutes ever for an all-NBA defensive team player. And the three other players that were the least amount were Bobby Jones, a Hall of Fame NBA player, 11 times all-NBA defense. Second player was Tony Allen, a six-time all-NBA defensive. I'm pretty sure... I may have this wrong, but I'm pretty sure Kobe Bryant said Tony Allen uh, always gave him the most trouble on the basketball court with his defense. And then number three, only a one-time All-NBA defensive, but he's young, DeJounte Murray. He has high potential. He can be an All-NBA defensive team player every single season. So those are three guys that he just beat and the minute amount he got for All-NBA defensive team uh, record. It's insane. Matisse Thibel has all the pieces, a defensive team. As long as he can get more minutes, I see him being a future defensive player of the year. Let me know what you guys think. Do you agree with me? Do you not? Let me know. Like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. I make NBA videos all the time. And I'm not stopping anytime soon. Peace.